Thibaut for another tutorial video. So today we're gonna see Akita mouse follower. So in the past I've done already a mouse follower with pure JavaScript and CSS. This time I'll try to reproduce the um, motion page uh, um, website uh, mouse follower. So you can see that I have two a big a bigger and a smaller follower to my mouse and when I hover some white text or some lighter the color is still changing and then when I'm hovering a button so therefore a link the big one is getting bigger so you can see up color is changing you can see the mouse and the link. So let's see how it's done in Bricks first. So I have um, some sections. It's just for the sake of having an example to reflect the effect of the uh, mouse follower. So each section are the same and can have a container, a heading and a button. So nothing special everything is centered uh, I put a hundred VH as a height and what is important is mix blend mode is different so when the that's giving the effect when the uh, mouse follower is over a certain part of the section so lighter text the follower is getting darker or the oppo let's say the opposite color of what is hovering on so and section i put some background color and that's it then container container is centered also style layout i've put some dummy uh, uh, padding top and bottom then background this is my image which i center it i put some uh, border radius 50 uh, pixel nothing special and a overlay over my picture and then a heading i put a stupid figure which is 300 pixel just to make it big so you can see on your on your screen the effect of the hovering of from the mouse follower and that's it and then the button uh, nothing special I'm making making it big and uh, and that's it but um, something you have to put if section are um, uh, mix blend mode is the body has to isolate the 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 page. Let's say uh, if I don't put the isolate, you see the the mix blend mode is taking effect. So to isolate the page, I'm making a body isolation isolate. So only the um, section together with the follower, uh, big and small, have an impact on with, with together with the mix blend mode. So then going to the follower, so start from the big one. So I get, gave a class Akita follower big. So everything is centered layout i put a width of two, 32 pixel and an aspect ratio of one position is fixed that's important and also which is important is to give a position of top and left at zero and i put a z index of 1000 to be sure that it's sitting on top of everything then i put in my mix blend mode uh, difference here also and I'm putting a pointer events none, so uh, there is no interaction with the mouse follower. 
Then I put a certain background color, a border radius, 50% so it's rounded. Uh, to be sure that the pointer is centered according to the position of your mouse, so the mouse is in the center of the follower, uh, you have to translate by its own size by 50% the, the x and the y. So translate x minus 50% and translate y minus 50%. And then I put a transition, I know it's not good, but it's the only way to make it work for, for in that case, is the transition to make the follower uh, not straight away uh, following your mouse. With, I, I'm giving a certain delay. The, 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 the length of the transition will be the delay, let's say, <laughs> of your uh, follower and your point to your point pointer so the that's for the big one the small one is almost the same but different color and different size smaller so 10 not 32 a different color and um, transform also 50 pass translate x and y uh, minus 50 percent and a different transition uh, one something shorter than the big one so we can see the effect you see that the small pointer is um, getting closer to the mouse faster than the big one so that's giving an interesting effect so that's it for uh, the bricks part. Then let's move on motion page. So I'm using uh, mouse movement on axis. Uh, I'm not triggering anything, so the viewport by default is used. And then I'm animating my Akita follower big on the X axis, and I'm putting a custom of left 100%. So X left 100%. Y a 2. X was also 2, not a from. And the custom property 2, top 100%. And something which is really important is don't put any is, so is known, otherwise you will have a some strange effect with the follower. Um, that's I'm doing the same for the small one. No, nothing, nothing is different. It's just I'm applying it on the Akita follower small. So on the X left hundred percent, and on the Y top hundred percent, and then. I'm created another animation for the when you are hovering a link. So every time there is a mouse over a link, so A, I'm transforming the Akita follower big to um, Why? Where is it? That's strange. Um, ah, maybe I deleted it. So, scale of two, saving my timeline, just to be sure that is working. Let's go on the front. Let's refresh. And when over, okay, it's working. So when I'm hovering a link, so a tag, the big one is scaling by twice of this size. Okay, so that's it for today. 
I will provide with the template for three today so you can enjoy the this animation. Thank you. See you at another animation. Bye.